<coughs> Great way to start. Me coughing. Anyway, welcome everybody to a new video of Blue City Battles. We're here in Sims Street Superdome with a really fun video idea today. Pop all tricks, and that is him donating to $50 to me, which means I'll be going with his strategy in my mind for the Spike Factory because we both know, or we all know, that Vortrix's favorite tower is the Spike Factory. So what I'm gonna do is play with this one game or even two games, considering how bad, how good maps are. And uh, yeah, if you see this Vortrix, I mean, I'll probably mention you in the title, but uh, if you see this, we all love you. All, we all love you. English, we all love you, and of course you're playing against Ukraine, which means you can go Spy Factory strategy. But we all love you, you make great content, you're the best YouTuber I know. So, Rainer, will be fun. So I'm gonna go with good old, good old, good job against this guy. And um, I'll be going with this strategy right here, and hope for the best that we can somehow win against this guy. Obviously we can we cannot really win this guy against this guy because Spike Factory, which kind of sucks. But yeah, we might have fun. To honor Vortex, obviously, we're gonna play with Spike Factories only in a really good map. But since this is not a good map, Spike Factory, we can't really do shit about it now, can we? So it's completely chill, it's fine. Um, he sent us Solings, so I don't really worry too much about the farm. And um, we'll just go for some space blues. Maybe force him somehow a uh, rip shot. Which he will probably not go for. Which I guess is fair. That's yeah, farm, which means I can go for the eco choke now. Mm hmm. Oh, cool. 270 at least. He's in pretty good boost, so he does not have a 2 4 hours, but he has technically knocked out bullshit, which we have to be worried about some, like, badly. <coughs> <coughs> Jesus. Alright, we should be fine here. Fucking hell, my voice. Good. We're fine. Yeah, he's fine as well, so I don't really have to send anything else anymore. Oh my, he's face bombing. Like, you're not any good, buddy. There we go. We should be fine here easily. Whew, my voice, like, died. Which is kind of stupid. <laughs> Oh my lord. Go for the faster shooting as well and go for the no farm. And after that I can probably send him a uh, green rush. Yeah. Mortar? Oh, he probably wanted to base on his car because he's on mobile. Yeah, I'm not gonna space on that. Even side oops. But that's that's fair. I'm not gonna upgrade my farm just yet because I feel like he's gonna rush me with yellows and I don't have the money to go for the mortar just yet. Yep. Ooh. Be fine, we can go for the bank and then we'll see what we can do after. Probably around 9 bank is pretty good. If we can sell this guy as well. Hmm, 600. Nice. Even had too much money as well in the bank. Pretty, pretty good. I'm happy. So we got money in the bank, which is really good now. Um, send him a little bit of a rush here. Also force the burning stuff. Funky acid, okay. He most likely has only quick shot, which I can easily counter. 
by using the motor saw. So I'm good with this. You can also use a damage boost if I need to. If I really need to. Well, he's playing really passive too. Maybe, maybe he is passive. Or going at least passive. And <laughs> that's not gonna do anything. Like this guy on close is like really really strong. So it's pretty good. If possible, I don't really want to collect this, but I have to. As the, the, the bank will be filled up soon. Um, yeah, that's gonna be hurting me a lot, technically. Hold on. I mean, I'm not gonna rush him, really. This guy also blows at this point. It's time for me to boost. Yeah, because I would have probably leaked a shit ton if I didn't. Right, we're good. If he's gonna rush me again, I can just go with this guy for a destroyer. Maybe two of them. Or, if possible, just like two plus C is all I need. <laughs> but I would think he's gonna make more up. If I follow up rush, we're just gonna be. Let's see if press behind, and then, yeah. I can always sell this farm if I need to, for a fucking near ability, which he does in descent. And looks like he's fine. Somewhat. Okay. Well, that's good for him. Game. If I buy this viable bananas, I don't really need too much money. Mom? Nice. So we're good. Don't need to worry too much about anything really. He, for whatever reason, sends me a BFP, that's pretty stupid, not gonna lie. And I'm gonna go for my factory as well at this point. That really should be fine. Which is hopefully the best we don't really leak down to uh, stupid rushes anymore. Now for the best we can somehow win, which we can technically do. It's pretty easy. I see going for another BI. Like, he already went for a factory, I wouldn't go for a factory at this point. Uh, for the ba bag, for BI at this point. What do you do, man? He actually went for the BI, that's kinda stupid. <coughs> I don't wanna collect, but I might do it. Yeah, why not? That's not gonna make me boost. Oh, necessary. See? It didn't make me boost. I'm happy. Alright, so I'm getting ready for another like back at this point. Of course he's going for more factories at this point, but I have two BIs. And two BIs are more better than one BI and one factory early on. Because two BIs early on will give me more money and the form better chances on survival. And if he rushes me I can always go for a big one.
which I don't think it's gonna do. Yeah, it's not gonna do it. Great. Great, great. And you can see I'm gonna catch up in farms. As uh, TBI's early on are gonna be way better than in your thing, by all means. Anyway, let's gonna do the same. Let's uh, sell this guy. Oh, big one. Ooh, we're good. Big OG. Actually, I've been pretty some strong now, actually. So we're going to focus on rushing them on around 32 plus with uh, CMGs. I wonder when he's going to sell his VI. It's probably when they're built up. Probably. Fine here. Yeah, easily. He can fit his farm there, which I cannot, most likely. Which would be annoying. Oh, I can, never mind. Never mind, we're good. Yeah, he saw this BI, which means he's gonna be having a bit more money. But after this round, I can also sell them, and we should be at this blow, fine. to be a little bit scary, I don't lie. Uh, we also catch up on farms because of the reek at this point. And hopefully we can fit two farms here. Because that's going to be a really good play here. We used to be going for another farm. Because that's how it used to be. But uh, it looks like it's not gonna happen. Yeah, because the pixel of the farm is a little bit too big now. Which means we can't even go for it, which is so sad. here will be on uh, strong because they're gonna be upgraded into the uh, aircraft gears anyway. So I'm going for them. He's on strong for now. Let's go for another big one. I mean, if he's not gonna rush me, I can probably just keep this out. I'll be fine. Let's go for this guy now. I mean, he should be fine easily. Oh, he's gonna send me Pascal instead. I don't know about that one, Chief. Now the lag that's gonna happen, which is gonna be really annoying. But remember, boys, we have what we call uh, damage boots, which is pretty good. We might boost later on. See, we don't lag out for now. It's pretty good. Maybe they fixed it. I'm still in green bar, which is beautiful. That's some shoes now. Look how it's gonna shred.
Okay, so I'm first good on sell these and keep my brain. Ooh, intense for Vortex video. Let's go. Oh, he also has a boost. Smart. Oh, yeah, also damage boost. Oh, no. This is really, really bad. And I still won because my mic was better. Fuck. Oh, GG. Jesus Christ. Yeah, he's definitely pissed off. I was like, what boost does he have? And I look over again when he boosted. I was like, fuck. Oh my god. So I'm not gonna showcase that last game because it was pretty annoying to play against someone who just went Dark and Corpora and Boomer against Ninja Gnu Super or Spike Factory on Super Monkey Lane. So I'm just not going to showcase that game at all. I actually showcase this game on uh, an offside, obviously, because offside is so much better than Super Monkey Lane. And if you do end up playing against a grinder, you can always, and I say this again, always go with better strategy. But this is the best strategy I can think of for homie Boltrix right here. So you're definitely going to be fine. Also, I just noticed I can mute my mic. That's pretty cool. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Okay, let's let's see. I'm definitely gonna go for this glue gunner here with a spike victory. And usually, he should be fine here. Of course, it's going farm. He might be going ninja super, which is super annoying. Play against, especially with me if you want a meme. We'll see. Oh, that. Okay. Oh, well, we might have a chance to win. <laughs> we might have a chance to win. It's gonna be really tough, though. He definitely is complete, though. As you can already see, he's not really echoing. Nor is he sending me goons to even force the goose better. So, we will not use any super boost at all. Till, like, if he showcase that he has actually any other power. But this should be more than enough. I'll we'll definitely go for a, a 1 0, that's for sure. And yeah, I'm just gonna laugh at this kid. Because I'm not gonna use Super Boost till he has little to none copious eco, basically. Uh, those, those, those things, those things do literally nothing. What are you, what are you doing, fam? All you do is gonna force me a 1 1 spike back green, that's all I need. <laughs> yeah, technically, because he stopped. Let's go. Okay, go for your Kobe Eco, buddy. Go for your freaking Kobe Eco, man. There we go. As if you knew I just hit the uh, 400 Eco. Bomb! Oh, I'm so good. Okay, we win these. We actually win these. I'm so sorry that I'm gonna be toxic now, but I'm gonna win these so easily that this idiot doesn't know how this game works. Darkling Bomb is so horrendous. So horrendous against eco players. I'm happy, I'm happy, I'm happy. Yippee! Okay, we're basically good. Also, it's been a while since he actually saw me using damage boost and lightning combo at the same time. It's really, really good. I really want to like make him 
he really mad for only having 549 e kill. So that he actually was sending me a lot of like yellow balloons or something. Um, let's see. I can always go for another spy factor if needed. Also, the later I use to be boosted for better as well. Hmm. I really want to eat, but that's the thing. There we go, finally. I'm gonna use the wrong 10 then. And if he sends me like a shit ton of your uh, things, I'll just go for a. What's the name? Lightning, and that handles just fine. We get easily to 1000 eco in the next two rounds because I've saved, saved up so much eco for money I meant. There we go. And I need to go. This can be A. And if he allows me, I can always go for a blue storm. This is gonna be a lightning spot easily. Cool, cool, cool. Let's go for the white hot spikes. Let this one go from these boosts, and I told you guys I actually got 1000 eco in round 12, which I said before. Two, two eco boosts left. Uh, two, uh, two rounds left. Why is he trying to be aggressive though? I mean, I have double stall, but his, he has dark lane, which is so good for late game. I'm sending him like flags to force defense, really. And you know what, I'm gonna go for it. Why not? My opponents also were pretty annoying against me when I was just trying to meme around. And they do give me 10 eco, and not 10, 60 eco every boon at this point. What should be fine here? I can go for spike balls. Come on. Perfect. <coughs> gonna send some flats and some flags. This is gonna do a lot of harm. Yep, the lightning. Cool. He's a little Timmy. Obviously, I'm a little Timmy too because I have a horse strategy, but I have a drop store. I could go for the drop store even, but. It's not gonna happen. It's not really a good power in general for that. It's definitely not a good power for that. He definitely is preparing for a late game, that's for sure, but... If he doesn't have a stall, I think Rev Doom spam is not gonna happen for him. I'm gonna have him go send him a more because he wants to go for the DI. Which, again, I disagree. Especially when you know your opponent's gonna be a little bit aggro. Timing as well. And he might be dead here. Unless the lightning is correct. Oh, and for the boom impact. Okay. I guess a BFB is uh, the case now. Because he has like bad uh, defense against BFBs. Definitely send him a BFB. If you see this world tricks, hopefully you're proud of me. Like, honestly. Hopefully you're really proud of me. And I'm still at 2,100 people, though, because why it's so key. This is a lot of money. Go for the eco pitch at this point. If he sends me a BFB, that's gonna be pretty stupid, I'm not gonna lie. Oh my lord, that's actually pretty stupid, what the hell are you doing? <laughs> Never send BFB against like Blue Gunner in general. Because they can easily defend, even if they like a ninja as the first tower and they you know, never, never showcase it. It's that simple. If he defended that, that's fine. Could be cooking. Probably go for 2.7k and then get ready for the defense. Yeah, like basically stop here. Get this even number for now. 
Um, let's use a lightning now. So I don't leak too much of my spike holes. I think I'm gonna go for a flash bomber right here on close. Another them. And at this point, we'll sell this guy for a Sabo. And um, yeah, you know, spikes on the shit out. There we go. Nice. I have to send him in CMG or else I'll lose. That's not what I want. I'm gonna lose a shit of eco, but he should be fine. He should be fine. I think it's spy hack because nobody would go for a bomb just so he can place it down. I don't believe that. I guess nobody would just base down 0 0 bomb and prepare for my CMG. This is what I don't believe, honestly. This is definitely what I do not believe. I believe he has spy hack. There is no way in hell. But he should be fine here if he has a good boost. Probably a beacon buster. Because late game. Oh, he made himself BI. Let's go. Let's go. We're good. Another boon impact, let's go. And he keeps E going. Fair enough. What's he say also C fans? Is he truly thinking I'm not gonna send him another CMG? Ah. Uh, really think that? I'm fine here. Especially with this lightning on the spot. Ah, damage boost this. Jesus. Yeah, if I'm being kind of aggressive, I have to damage boost. And we made him sell another BI. Let's go. No free eco for you. Yes! We did not give him a free eco. Beautiful, beautiful. At this point, we have to focus on getting this flash bomber here. Those are loose, and I don't want that. This should be fine. Yeah, nice. That can be, no lie. Maybe okay, we're good. I guess I have to send him an early CMG round, 30 ish, at this point. And every each round, I'm gonna send him one CMG. It's like space, but way too spaced. <coughs> Use of the buff. Or the uh, ramping. But yeah, I'm gonna, at this point, save up my money. Oh, well, echoing, obviously. And. Every round I'm gonna send him one CMG. It's gonna hurt me a lot with Eco, obviously, but you should know at this point I'm gonna be aggressive. It's gonna hurt him a lot if he doesn't know it or prepare himself a lot. Like, I don't think this defense is more enough to defend a singular CMG on round 35. Definitely needs his like rare dom, a rear boom, a uh, mob assassin, definitely, multiple even. Uh, yeah, he's preparing himself, so I'm not gonna rush him. I'm gonna keep equaling. But good thing is, his strategy is like really bad against group CMGs. Like early on. That's what I'm focusing on. Because he doesn't have too much eco. It's just gonna be beautiful. I somehow make it sink. Somehow. It's fine. I guess I'm sending around 32 CMG. 
Thanks for so many BIs. There we go. I do believe this defense should be more enough. There we go, everything should be glued. And yeah, we should be definitely fine here. I have no idea how long this guy can last. Because I never really play with Darkwing Bomb, nor do I really play with Darkwing Bomb. So I'm playing against it. So it's gonna be really tough to know how I'm gonna throw this guy. He already sends me a CMG. I'm just gonna train your ego like that. It's not smart. That's really not smart. Yeah, I guess 135 is the way, because I don't think he has any chance to winning. Like, this map is not even built with BIs, like I can fit at least 8 more of them, at least. <coughs> I should defend, just fine, got a single boost. I've got spike mines now, and spike mines will be correct. Yeah, I think round 35, I'm gonna send up another CMG. And afterwards I can send like Astrodon straight on. And he goes to Astrodon again. Hopefully I can do some harm to this guy, but I don't know. Or spec mines are definitely good enough. I think for the damn, he already has so much money in the eco that he can go for a rod. And a raw for a rod. Okay. That's gonna be hurting me a lot. It's gonna be really bad. I don't think I'm gonna win this game. I'm so sorry for Boltrix. I uh, disappointed him, that's for sure. But hey. I say I didn't trust, I didn't uh, give my best, I guess. I definitely give my best. I, I definitely gave my best. I feel like he's gonna allow me soon, because he just sold so many BIs. It's gonna be spooky. This is very, very spooky. Let's be real. Let's be real. This is like very spooky. And don't say you would won this game. I don't believe you guys. I'm sorry. But... I don't think neither of us would have won this game. But there's a possibility I can win somehow, but I don't believe it. Maybe around 48. Maybe 48. As long as he doesn't send me like CMG right away. He doesn't have a stall. If he rushes me first, I can always rush him back. back. In that yeah, because he does not have a stall. It's gonna be really good. So if he says if I see he's gonna rush me, I'll rush him back and uh you know, should be fine. He has no more BIs left, I'm actually spooked. She spooked. I don't know what I'm doing anymore. <laughs> okay, I think that's enough for spy factories.
Doesn't have too many rods, which is good. But trust me, not even too many will help him a lot. It's a wonder. with my pre-ordered like storm I'm looking at the screen right now to see if he's gonna now sell his PI but it doesn't seem like it I accidentally bought two of them but it's good because of the CMG later on we'll be uh, on the power field soon I don't believe I need a uh, server for this round. It do be kind of spooky, I know, but it's fine. Cool. So fine. In a servo. And triple fine. Once I see multiple CMGs, I'm gonna rush him. I'm gonna rush him. Oh, he saw this all his BI. He might rush me soon. It's gonna be really, really spooky. <laughs> I think everything here can handle one CMG pretty nicely. Yeah, like it's gonna be tough anyway. Beautiful, beautiful. I think I'm gonna save up my money now. I'm not gonna upgrade anything unless it's necessary. And then we'll be fine. Yeah, I think that's gonna be good, really good. Because if he rushes me, I will literally counter him and it's only just Sabo. And I'm proceeding to up more upgrades because this is good enough. Is that his rush? It is, okay. This is rush, 148 like I said before. And then after that we are definitely cooking. So again if I need to. Come on, there we go. Settle. Should be dead, like, like right now. We have double stall. We have literally double stall. Come on, I somehow lose this. That'd be really, really sad. Go! Ninja Glue Spy Factory is the shit. Ha! It's the shit. The reason I didn't shout like I usually do is because it's almost 12 a.m. and my grand my grandpa is in his bedroom. So that's the reason why. But hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hope you guys also enjoyed it and hope you all tricks have enjoyed this video. It's really tough to find a really good map for this strategy in general, but again, thank you everybody for watching, especially you, Portrick. Thank you for the $50, and as usual, thank you everybody for watching. If you're new, feel free to subscribe, as always, so you can always change one later. And if you're new and already subscribed, feel free to join my membership, as you've heard it already heard or noticed me mentioning multiple times. I'm jobless, I don't know what to do, but um, thank you. Everybody, for your support lately, especially with the views, and have a nice, juicy day as usual. So, see you guys. See ya.